Hello everyone! Oh, welcome to the Unfiltered Gamer live stream. I'm Callie here tonight with Caleb Hello. <laughs> and Michael and Michael's trying to do the fog machine and Dante joining us for the intro. Ooh, and it's the spooky Halloween edition. <laughs> um, the game that we're playing tonight is Pacific Rails Inc. by the Sioux Vesuvius Media. <laughs> it is a railroad building game for two to four players, ages 12 and up. Should take about 45 minutes to play. Yep. Uh, this So it's Ello and Vesuvius, oh, okay. like a crossover promotion of the game. In the game, you're basically going to be having two separate trains on each side of a continent, and you're trying to connect those trains by rail. There's three different ways you can connect trains. It's either by the ocean, we're using bridges, uh, you can use tunnels to the mountains or hills, and then finally the basic laid tracks, which are going to go on the basic spaces on the board. Mm -hmm. You're also going to be building your train. You'll start with the main frontal, and you go to the caboose, and you'll like move on. You, you'll add carriages as you build that up. Uh as you develop your track. And as you get to each new unique city. Yeah. Now, so mm -hmm. it's going to basically gonna like upgrade your train for doing well. Um, and you'll also be getting, getting new characters on your train as well. They'll give you new abilities, bonus abilities. You'll be utilizing the um, government to benefit you. And then there's mm -hmm. also unique ways in which you're going to be placing down track. And, of course, a victory condition marker. Or victory additional, like, victory conditions you can... Yeah. Or, Additional victory points Objective. that you can gain yeah. with the four objectives that we picked, and there's a variety of them in the game. Uh, that's the basic idea of the oh. game: gather oh, resources. And it's a yeah, gather resources, <laughs> place your workers, go ahead and lay down tracks, and then if you can connect the rails, that'll end the game. Whoever has the most victory points mm -hmm. is the winner. We'll take you to the top down and yeah. show you how that's played. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was just gonna say, if you can be the one to connect the track, you get a bunch of bonus points, like fifteen victory points. So oh, I didn't know that. Deal. I forgot to mention that to you earlier. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and show you how the game is played. I'll take you to the top-down version. We'll give you an idea, and then uh, we'll come up and talk about how we thought about the game. So hope you guys enjoyed this one. This is a Halloween stream. I mean, it's close to day to Halloween. <laughs> um, and because of that, if you're watching this video and you're a comment, just at least do a comment. If you want to do a like, follow, whatever. If you want to join us on Twitch, you'll probably see the video better in 1080p. Because um, the board is large, the game is a big one. It's pretty detailed, <laughs> this game. <laughs> um, but we will be giving away games. And in fact, over here is a big stack of games that I'm currently going to be giving um, away. Well, random ones throughout the stack, based on how many people we have tonight watching. You know, if we have a lower stream like usual, it's fine. We'll give away one or two games. But if we get enough people in the stream, and hopefully there's no technical issues, then I'll be rolling and spinning this little like wheel here, pulling out random... Um, balls, and each of those balls has a different color, which is associated with a different game. I'll have Caleb do it since he, he doesn't know which is which. And you can win <laughs> games like Fly Away, Moon Shell, Blasting Boxes, Nightmare Forest, Bonk, War, Villagers, Crazy Cake, Growl, Yaks, A Deck of Playing Card Cats, and Robotech the Card Game. Okay, so that's all I got for you. Let's go ahead and take you to the top down. All right, here's the top down view. You can see the game. We have a big board in the middle. This is our, our map. Um, and we each have our little trains on either side. Now, normally you draft the train locations. I yes. place, then Callie, then Caleb. But we just went ahead and set the whole board as is, and we gave each other random specific bonus um, resources. So I have a bonus wood. She's got steel, and Caleb has uh, barrels. barrels. What is okay. it? What the bar barrels are they? What's in them? Oh, gunpowder. Gunpowder. Okay. Yes. Um, so yeah, this is a worker placement game, and I explained it a little bit to Caleb, Callie explained it to me, so we'll see how this game of telephone is going to go. But there are nine locations on the board, represented over here. This is where we're going to be doing all of our worker placement in the game. We will be taking our workers and placing them on any of the footprint spaces. When we do that, we'll take an action. It'll either be the one adjacent on the bottom, or on top, or maybe it'll be a left or a right. And in either case, you be pick one of those and do that action. Mm -hmm. uh, if you want, and maybe you have all your workers on the board or a certain amount of workers and you want to take some off, you can take them off. And when you do that, you'll choose a location and you will take that action. Additionally, if you have workers that are adjacent to that action, you'll get bonuses, whether it be additional resources or to take the action again. Uh, but either way, you're going to be taking off and putting on workers. The final thing you need to know, a uh, very brief summary, is if a space is completely surrounded, you can take your worker and place it in the middle. And if you do that, the other player who's surrounded that area is going to be removed, and they'll get a bonus. They'll get cowboy hats. 
one per worker up to two. And cowboy hats are basically going to constitute, con con constitute workers adjacent to locations. Yeah. So if I have one worker down on the location, but I want to use that as a bonus action one or two times, I can use cowboy hats to assist me in that. I imagine in a, the biggest player game, four players, you're gonna see a lot more of that happening. Yeah. In a smaller game, you'll see a lot less of that happening. Um, but yeah, there are nine actions and we'll go over them. But remember, before we go into the actions, I just want to let you know that if you haven't commented and you are watching or lurking, just say hello. That way I can give you a chance to win a game. Basically at the end of the night, I will spin this wheel off and I will elect mm -hmm. some winners for some games. Say happy Halloween and what you're dressing as tomorrow, yeah. <laughs> if you are. Yep. So that's it. All you gotta do is comment. Um, and if you wanna do any other things like following that is greatly appreciated. So nine actions. One action is going to be gathering barrels. Another is going to be gathering steel, coins, and wood. And each of them have a bonus action that you can take if you would like. Like for instance, putting a house on this board over here, uh, you can, which will give you bonuses. You could go ahead and place a house on the map over here, which will give you victory points and bonuses on your player board. You can place, um, spend a barrel to place an upgrade on your uh, extra carriages. Yeah. And you could spend a coin to place these little power lines mm -hmm. onto the map on the cities that have previously been reached from by another train. Uh, then you have your other actions. You're going to be able to do the like government action, which Lobbying. will basically yeah. associate you getting certain resources or bonus abilities if you spend a coin. You're going to be spending uh, resources for the three different types of track. So wood for bridges, uh, the gunpowder for the mines or like Tunnel. the tunnels, yeah. and then the steel will get you regular tracks. And that's pretty much it. Now, each of the locations that has a little conductor or person that represents a train will let you activate all bonuses on your train. And you'll see that as we play the game. Our train, our player board is going to get much larger. We'll try yeah. and accommodate for pretty space. Small now, but, but we'll see what we can do, and I'll explain as that goes along. And the game is going to end when one of us or any of us make our tracks touch because we can use our tracks together. Um, there's some other bonus variables and rules that we'll associate with as we go along the game and that Caleb will probably have to know. But as for that, it's pretty straightforward. I'll start the game since uh, we probably know the game the best and then uh, we'll just go from there, I suppose. You ready to play some Pacific Rails Inc.? Let's go, choo-choo. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna place my guy first. Now I have currently one of each resource. Um, I don't have any train tracks spots. though. Yeah. That's right, so I'm gonna need to spend resources in order to gain. Now, I know I wanna reach this, this area here, this city. Uh, in order to do that, I'm going to need a regular train track. So if I place my red guy right here, I can spend a steel and I can then get any type of train track I want. Um, that is on a basic land area. Now, in general, it doesn't matter. The square is a square, but uh, to make things more efficient, you should pick the, the piece that matches. I did organize them. So I could, when I place these this down, it'll kind of curve to the right. If it didn't curve to the right, if it went straight, it still would be fine to connect to the city though. So mm -hmm. it's just kind of for, for aesthetics. aesthetics. <laughs> so I would take this track and I'm gonna put it into my reserves. So I can't place it yet until I do this action here, but I now at least have it for my availability. Yeah. Uh, I'm done. That's it. My turn is okay. over. I'm going to do something similar, but I'll place right here. Okay. And I'm going to actually do, yeah, the same action and get a regular track. Any specific one you want? Um, straight. Okay. Or, actually, oh. it's fine. This is good. Okay. They're, they're double-sided. They're yeah. all going to be straight, but if you want a specific type, I can do that as well. I got it. All right. Um, Caleb, you're up. All right. Um, I need... A tunnel. A tunnel, okay. So this is a tunnel space. So you can put it here, here, or here. Remember, when you take it off, it'll let you choose one of the two spaces. So it depends on what your next mm. action is. Mm. It's not going to hurt you either way. I wouldn't make it, do not make a big deal about it. Literally yeah. just pick a space. But it will matter as we, as we start Later. progressing. Yeah. So I'm going to spend a barrel. Yep. And just put it over there. And then you're going to get a uh, tunnel piece. Okay. Just like that. Okay. Uh, now it's my turn. Now, so it goes I, into your cargo area. Yep. So I'll, I'll just try and uh, take a gander here as to what I'm supposed to do. So if I put this here, I can now place tracks. Mm -hmm. That's my action. So I'm going to take this track here, and I have to place my tracks, have to go from where I'm currently at to the next city I want to go to. Yes. So I'm going to place this track here, and luckily there's a city here. 
and this will take my train because you're going to place tracks on cities or on loca on locations like building areas and i'm going to do 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 and fly over here yes when you reach your first city you what are you going to get so first you're going to choose if you want to build the station with one of your houses there or the telegraph pole i think i'm going to do a station okay so you'll take the one of the houses off from the left side there yeah i can choose it. any of the four different ones there's yeah. wood steel coins and gunpowder so it'll give you bonuses to collecting those resources i'll put my little house there yes and now you'll get points um oh and and secondly you'll get your carriage so, so just take this that. and it goes right here yes and then you'll also get points um based on the mm. tracks that you place as long as they were from the closest city, which the starting point counts. So okay. that's two points if you place that track this turn. I did. And then let me see if there's another bonus for your build. Don't I get a conductor or get a character as well for free? Yes. With the first carriage, you'll get one of these for free. Uh, so I'll take this guy here. He lets me turn. He lets me... He's the steel regular um, rails guy. I think I'll need regular rails throughout this game. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yeah, you get two points for laying this track I this that. turn. And then if later someone else goes through your the city that has your building here, yeah. you'll get three points. Okay. They won't. So that's how that works. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of far one. away in the corner there. But later when we get up in here, we might be using each other's tracks. Okay, I'm done. Okay. I'm going to place here and use... Um, spend a wood. Spend a wood. Okay. To get a bridge. Just a straight bridge? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> All right, what do you want to do? Mm -hmm. So if I place here, I can lay that down? You certainly can. Okay. <laughs> okay, you place there. Now you're going to choose to do place tracks. Take all the tracks you'd like to place and put them down in front of your train. Okay, so that's going through the mountains. And let's fly your train over to the city. Great. You've reached the city, so you're going to choose house or a um, the electric wires. What is it called? What are they calling them? In the game? Uh, telegraph pole. Telegraph yeah, poles. Yeah, or, or station or whatever. So, um, I'll do a house. Okay, so you choose a house from the left-hand side of each of any of the four areas. Okay, the wood one, and you put it on there. Okay, you're going to gain points. You will get two points for placing one track down, so you'd move this guy up to two. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to get this, and you can place it on this side. And you choose any one guy you want. Now these guys give you a benefit. What are the benefits, Callie? So they're very similar to the spaces here. So the exact same, really. Turning in the steel for tracks, gunpowder for tunnels, wood for bridges, coins for lobbying. Yeah. Okay. So do you want a specific type of track or do you want a lobby? It's not a thing you'll do now. It's when you'll use a space that requires mm -hmm. it or offers it. Um... If you're going through the water, you want bridge. Um, well, I was just... No, I'll do the, the tunnel. Great. Put it on there. Okay, you're done. Uh, my turn. I need more resources, I think. Mm -hmm. I don't have any steel, though. Um, well... Shoot, I need to go through the water too, though. It looks like both, both your train. Yeah, is the water available? It, it is here. I will go here. I will spend a wood, yep. and that will net me. Remember, you can also take off your character. I know I don't want to. Yet. Okay, yeah. Uh, and I will get a bridge. And I'll store it. Now, I could do it again because I have another one of these guys here, but I don't have the resources for it. Yeah. So I'm going to be done. <laughs> okay. And I need to lay track. So go here. 
I was trying to get into position to lay too, but Michael took my spot. <laughs> So I'm gonna oh, is that why you asked me to remove my worker? No, no. <laughs> Just to let you know, you can remove your worker. I'll place this one at the bridge, and then my train will go through. All right. So you just, just yes. take that. You're Thank gonna get you. two victory points. I'm gonna put a, uh, the house down to act as a railroad. And what station. do you want? Which guy? I want barrel guy. Okay. Of course. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can get it later. No. Thank you. Okay. Caleb's turn. So this will let me get either a straight train track. It'll let or... you get. It'll just let you get all any of these you want. These are all irrelevant. Like oh, it's just okay. for aesthetics. There's only three types. You have regular trains. Sorry, you have you have water. The water. You have not water, and then you've got the mountain areas. And remember that the white areas you cannot cross. The big like. Mount Everest type lo locations, you can't go through those. They're too, it's too muchness, much muchness. So if I place my guy here in the middle, you cannot place your guy there unless all spaces around it are oh, blocked. Okay. So the only place you can place is right here. But I can put that here. Sure. No, he would have to take his character. From but there. I can put Wait. that here to still get this. Right? Yes. He has two units left. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but oh no, I just mean he can't place in the middle there because he's got a guy here. He could just remove it to use that. Oh, right, right, right. Only yeah. if you cannot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, you want that? Yeah, you got to pay a steal. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Let me just put it in there. All right, my turn. I will place my guy here. And I'm going to get one steal, plus one more, plus one more, because I have... Two guys there and a bonus. So that's going to give me three steel. One, two, three. That's it. Okay. I want some barrels. So I'll get one and two barrels, please. And what's the bonus action there? Um, well, the bonus action for you over here is spend a coin to place a one of these guys down on oh, the board. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So, coin. And you can place it anywhere that you want? Yeah, so as long as there's, there has to be a railroad station and it can't be my own. So I can never, you can never place your own telegraph on there. But I could place right there. And that's going to give you victory points at the end of the game? Yes. Okay. And <laughs> one right now for uncovering it. You stole my spot. <laughs> All right, you're but you can't Caleb. place there anyway. <laughs> if I want to build a railroad, do I have to take your guy my off? Guy and then yes. Yeah. So you take your guy off. Perfect. And now you can build, place any number of railroads to connect from your city. Now remember, you can't. Where do you want to? Where do you want to build to? You have to build. So in order for you to build railways with this guy, you're going to have to connect him to a city. So you have to go one, two, and then. That would connect you. You, need two tracks. you can't oh, just simply so put have, one I need track to have down. All, I need to have two. Yes. yes. You'll here. need to have all in order to connect. So if I wanted to go from one. here to here, I would need one, two, three, four. Three. Uh, sorry, one, two, three. Yeah. Uh, you could do one over here if you wanted mm -hmm. and connect to a city. And that would get you another caboose, right? Yes. Um, okay. <laughs> another carriage. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you go there, uh, choose, you want to place a house, or do you want to place your little lines? A You're house. also going to get two more points, putting you at four. And you'll take the second one there. There you go. <laughs> okay, my turn. Mm -hmm. oh, water. I'm not sure what I want to do. Gonna have to take a worker though. <laughs> I know. Um, one, two, three. Hmm. I guess I can take this guy here. 
to place down track. I'll put my water one over here and then I'll slide my guy on over. I don't really need to do, I don't really need it for this purpose here, but this will start getting me even more bonus resources, which is nice. Mm -hmm. I'll get two more points from that to kind of catch up a little bit. Um, that's all it does, I think. All right. I'm going to, oh, I don't have the deal for that one. Mm. Grab the comments and yeah, keep going. Yeah, see what's going on. Okay. I need, I have to remove my guy here. No. Okay. Mm. I'm going to remove him and I have this track I can place. So I could choose, you could also with this bot hire one of these and they'll cost whatever, depending on the level of carriage. And you always have to place on the left first. So I'm going to place this one here and we'll go along to the next city. Yes. Place the building, become the train station, get two points please for blue. Does it? Okay. <laughs> I need more resources. <laughs> right. Okay. <clears throat> So you can get resources from here too, from lobbying with the coins. Do I need wood for anything though? The wood will be for crossing water. Um, yeah, I don't plan on doing that no. at the moment. You, you could right here. <laughs> but you don't have to go through here, you could go this way. Hmm. Kind of, yeah. the map is pretty flexible. The only <laughs> spots that you can't go over are these white, really tall mountains. I, yeah, I guess I could go over water. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> so that would be wood, but I'm over here where the wood is at. <laughs> you need wood? Yeah. yeah. Then so you, you remove, remove your character your yeah. and you gain wood. You get one wood plus any bonus wood you would get from your board. Which is one, so you'll get two. Okay, hey, good deal. Okay, my turn. I also need wood, <laughs> I believe. For bridge. You want to cross water? Yeah, I'm gonna place it here. This will give me two wood. One for my bonus, and then one extra. And these are all extra spaces I can use, right? On my board here? Yes, those are extra cargo. Oh, I forgot to get my second carriage. You have to move your board all yeah. over. There you go, that's fine. Yep. I'm done. Okay, I really need to steal <laughs> Michael's blocking it. So I have to go here. When you do, you remove my parrot people? Yes. And I'm gonna get two hats? Yes. Oh, thank you. Uh, I know, but I had to, you're blocking that area. I know. It was an accident. But I'm going to get three steel, which is great. It's worth it. Whoa. One, two, three. Thank you. Go ahead, Caleb. All right. The uh, cities start being a little more um, <laughs> difficult to reach as you move on. Yes. So they're going to be farther apart now. We need to have at least two pieces of track to get to our next city. And when I want to build, for instance, if I wanted to build more 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 streets, right, more regular regular track, track uh -huh. this is only going to give you give me one basically, right? Yes. There's no bonus. It's going to activate all your guys though. That's true. So Let me do another one yes. here. Your specialists, that's what they're called. And you can buy more of them so too, see. with the what do you want? action. This is to go through the, the water. water. Yep. Place that there. You can now spend a wood for a one of these guys. Just one, or can it be two? It's just one, okay. unless you have a hat or an, another guy that's adjacent of your color, which you oh, don't. Oh, I see. 
So, but the next time you, when you go here, you'll get to do it twice because you'll have a guy here. Okay. Mm -hmm. If it stays open. <laughs> if it stays open. Hmm. Water spaces. How I can get one water. I need. I guess I need regular ones. Which means I have to take away a guy. Mm -hmm. So I can take this guy away. I can spend one steel for a regular one, and I can spend another steel for a regular one because it activates my caboose, and this guy here has uh, spend one for a regular. Correct? Yeah. Okay. Two. So I need a straightaway and a windy one. Could it be caboose? Yeah. All right. So I have to, since I have all my guys on the board and I have one in the middle. You have to take one out the middle. Yes. So. Little rules we'll give you as we go along. Yeah. It's uh, easier that way. Three steel, please. Wow. A lot of steel. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, I'll, I'll work with it. I Your guess. turn, Caleb. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, okay. What would you place? Right here. Okay, so yeah, you're gonna get one steel. No, he's he's putting turning in wood for a bridge. Yeah. So you can do that again oh, if for this you one. want to. And yeah, yeah, you can you can do it again if you want to. You wanna do that again? Um, you have two guys here, you can have two bridges instead of just one. Well, I You might need it for later. Do I need it? You might need it for later though. Mm -hmm. It's not a bad idea to do it. If you have enough space, you have enough. <laughs> yeah, and you have plenty space. of space. Do it. <laughs> there you go. Get another the one. only other thing the resources really buy is some of the special actions and then the specialists here. My turn. Wow, there's <laughs> lots of. I need. Well, I guess I'll have to wait on that. I guess I'll place here, which will then let. I'm going to place track down. I'll put these two tracks down. Put one here. Mm -hmm. And one over here. Mm -hmm. My train will travel to the next city. And once again, I will get another house down. Okay. And this time, it's my third city, so I'll get the last one here. Which is just way extra space than I need currently, but I'll just put it over here. <laughs> yeah. Um, when I place that one down, I'm going to get points now, right? How many points will I get for getting there? So, two, four. Four points. Red is going up four. One, two, three, and four. So I put my house down. I got my last one. So any more cities that I visit, I won't get any more. Yeah. And I get two points for each of the of the railways. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go here. And I'm actually going to hire... I'm going to hire this guy here. <clears throat> it's going to cost me one barrel and one steel. Yeah. And it tells you on here. Yeah, because I'm going to put him in my... Number I have to put him slot. in my first carriage. You have to hire them from left to right. All right, Caleb, you're up. I'm going to build... That's right. Now, you, now you're going to get your third okay. and final area. Mm -hmm. You're also going to get four points. One, two, three, and four. And you put the house down? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, you guys are pretty close over here, so the next person to build tracks, the other person can actually use those tracks. Mm-hmm. If you can get it connected. But whenever you're building tracks, you always have to go to a new city. What do I want to do is the question. <laughs> right. I need barrels. How am I going to get them? They're over there in the corner. Oh, yeah. It's just Caleb and I there. So I have to go here. Yeah. I'll return you guys. <laughs> and you're each going to get a hat. Thanks. I needed a guy. And that's going to give me one, <laughs> uh, two barrels because I have a bonus here. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. Okay, let's get some track. I will place this guy and I'm going to do this. Okay, how many tracks are you going to get? So that'll be two there. And then I'm going to activate my train and I'll get one tunnel and one more straight track. Okay, so you want how many tracks so, do you want? Four? Uh, three tracks and uh -huh. one tunnel. Okay. Thank you. I think I found a use for uh, <laughs> these these things here. Oh, there we go. I we think could it's have resources. Them all be different resources. <laughs> be a little easier to hold. There's one over there with um, over there in the corner there, Caleb. It's uh, Caleb's turn. Um, I need uh, steel. So if I place it here, that's two or one steel. That that'll give you a bonus steel, and you could you also look at your board to see if you get any. So bonus you get no bonus stuff. on your board because okay. you don't have a plus one there, but you are gonna get two steel. Okay, me. I need to build a dude. And, and you're blo you guys are all blocking me, so I have to use this one here. I want to do the conductor, right? So I'm gonna take this guy off, mm -hmm. and I'm also gonna use a hat, so that'll give me two builds. So the first one's going to cost me a steel, and it's going to cost me a barrel. Mm -hmm. And that will get me a guy, and I want one that does mountains. And then I'm going to do another guy, actually. So I'm going to do a barrel and a wood, so I can use it for the next train. And that guy is going to get, give me a bridge. But I always have to build left to right. So before I can go to my third one here, I have to actually place another guy here. Right? Yes. But, but now, because I have guys, uh, do I only need one guy to build my upgrade, or can I have? Do I have you to have only both? need one to have an upgrade. Okay, so I can do two upgrades next yeah. time. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm done. Okay. <clears throat> no bonus points for placing down my guys, though. No. Okay. Um, I'm going to remove here to get barrels. I'll get two barrels. Okay. Thanks. Your turn, Caleb. Hmm. So you have to remove yeah. one, and then you'll choose one action. Hmm. I'm running out of resources. Callie's got tons. Well, I'm one city behind you guys. <clears throat> you're, you're focusing on the build-up, okay? Yeah, remove a guy. It's all right. Yep. No, I know, but I'm looking... I'm looking for what guy I wanted to remove. Okay, mm -hmm. do you want to use this action? Or this one? Uh, this one. Okay, so it's going to give you one, two steel. And then you can spend a wood. You don't have that, so that's it. My turn. I need barrels. I need barrels pretty badly. Oh, I have to remove this guy then? No, only if you are going to remove a guy. Okay, so if I place this guy down, I can actually get two barrels then. I think so. Plus one is three barrels. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go here, and I'm going to lay down track twice. Okay. And each time you lay down track, you have to go to a new city. Yes. And you'll be placing down a, a house or a pole. Okay, with this one gonna go here. That's gonna let you four points. One, I'll two, three, and four. Place a house. Okay. And then over here, I'm going this way. And I'll place another house. Okay. And that's, and that's another, two, another four points. Four points. Yeah. One, two, three, and four. All right. You're, you're ahead of the pack now. Me and Caleb are uh -huh. trailing behind. Your turn, Caleb. Um, <clears throat> For those of you guys who are lurking, make sure you comment below. Uh, just comment and say hello. I have a bunch of games to give away back here. And I'll have somebody uh, grab random balls from here to see what you guys can get. All these games are available. We're playing Pacific Rails, Inc. By Vesuvius Media and Ello. 
I need a barrel. Um, and you get any bonus barrels? You do. You get you two do. bonus barrels. Yeah. Get all your barrels. All right. I'm going to remove my guy here. He's going to go back. Oh, I have to. If I want to remove, I have to remove this guy, yeah. don't I? Uh -huh. I really don't want to do that because I don't need any more barrels. Three more barrels. That's sad. It's going to be plus one. And then plus one more. Total of three. But I can do the bonus action. I can spend this gold coin to place one of these guys on one of your locations, Callie. Let's place sure. it here. Go for it. <laughs> there. Now, I, now we can communicate. <laughs> All right. Your turn. Okay. I need wood. I should have removed one of the houses, but oh well. I'm going to remove this guy. Oh, that's great. To I get to one wood. <laughs> but I can't. And I can also spend a barrel to get an upgrade. That sounds like a good thing. Okay, what upgrade do you want? Go gold, wood, or barrel? Let's get um, barrel. Thank you. Okay. That's it. Caleb, your turn. It's serious business time. Yes. <laughs> I don't need any more barrels. I'm gonna start. You're gonna probably start needing track here pretty soon. Okay. Yeah, but I need wood, and I can't go over here. Here, you can remove a unit. I yeah. thought this was to spend. Oh, spend. Where's the wood at? That you need so here? here. You can put one guy right there. I don't have a guy. You, you gotta take gotta a guy remove. off. Yep. <laughs> gotta plan ahead. What? You can take this guy off. You could hire. Use, you could take this guy off, use the ability, and you need wood, you can move this down for two wood. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. So take this guy off, you then push this down, and it'll generate you two wood. And a victory point. No. Oh. It's just two wood. If you the push you, it up. When you push it up, you get a victory point. You shouldn't get a victory point in addition to it, do you? Let me make sure. Okay. Either way, it'll be my turn next. I'm going to take one of my guys and place it here. And I'm going to spend, oh, I'm going to get wood. Oh, you're right. Okay. One, two, three wood. Now, with the bonus action, do I also get the bonus? Um, can I do it more than once? This here? Um, I want to sp I don't think so. I think it's just for w one extra wood. Spend a barrel. It'll give me two. One, two. Let me pick a resource. I'll choose... Um, I'll choose coins, actually. Yeah, if I can do that bonus, that's great, because i got a ton of barrels I want to get rid of. And I definitely don't want any more wood. Well, either way, it's your turn. You can okay. take it and then, right. and then see after that. Yeah. Oh, um... Uh, do I want to activate yet? Yes. I'm going to do this one and get uh, tunnels. Tunnel. How many do you want? Barrel. So I'm going to activate here. So I'll turn in one for a tunnel. Then I'll get a barrel. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this I'm just trying to do it right. <laughs> Thank you. And Why do you get a barrel? Right oh, here. okay. I'm going to activate my carriage, and then I do a barrel. Really? You're going to make me take it back again? Yes. For another tunnel? I'm going to make you do this next time, since okay. you don't know how to Sorry. do math. And then the um, straight tracks, too. Thank you. I'm going to put resources on your side. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Go ahead, Caleb. Go ahead, Caleb. My, my bet is Kelly crushes us in this game. That's the only thing she knows how to do. Crush, crush. people. Yeah. Um, I'm going to need a lot of tunnels. <laughs> I'm going to remove him. Yep. And I'll just take a steel. Okay. 
I've got lots of barrels that need to go for mountains, I guess. Um, I'll have to put this guy here. It'll give me one. I can spend it twice, yeah. two barrels. I guess. Yeah, two barrels for a, a mount, two mountains. And then I'll activate my caboose, which will give me a gold. And I can also spend another barrel for another mountain. And I can spend a wood for a straightaway. Okay. Okay. I will. I'm going to go here and I'll get two, three gold. One, two, three? Yeah. And then there's no place to put a house. Nope. So I won't do that. Okay. That's it. Okay. <clears throat> So, how do I go here? It's being blocked. There, you can, if you really want to go there. You can put your guy in the middle yep, and, and return ours. Off. Okay. So, we got our guys back. Kelly gets her guy back. Mm -hmm. And then we fill up our hats. I only had, I, only, I didn't use all my hats, sadly. I didn't realize okay. I was going to get knocked yeah. off again. <laughs> right. You're okay, though. You only had one hat. Yep. Yeah, it's perfect for me. I just gotta remember to use it. Get a straight away. You can activate your caboose. If you want, you can turn in a barrel for a mountain. You wanna do that? Oh. You activate, yeah, Once, whenever you reach a space with a guy on it, you're gonna get to activate all That's this great. down the line. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what I need. Perfect. That's why it's good to hire a specialist, too. I need. Hmm. And now I see a clear path to get to where I need to go. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we'll get now. If I get too many resources, I have to get rid of some resources. Correct? Yes, you'll have to discard them. Um, I guess I'll remove this guy to do an upgrade for two for a wood. Oh, uh, two two wood and a coin. Um for this space mm -hmm. here. Um, and I want another straightaway for steel. Oh. Okay? Yes. I'm Sorry, done. I should have the three as well. I forgot the other last time. <laughs> Just put it above your <laughs> yeah. board. Okay. And I'm gonna go here, activate this guy, and I'm gonna use a hat so I can spend two coin for the three resources of any type. And I'll get um, a barrel uh -huh. and a wood. A barrel and a wood? Yes. For three oh, resources sorry. of any and, type? And one more wood. Thank you. All right. If I want to go here again, do I need we to have to remove, remove that guy? Me? Yeah. Wait, no, you can place a guy over here if you want. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So now you can get you can place you can two steel for a straightaway, and then you can spend another barrel for an underground. Two steel for two straightaways because you have two guys, and then one barrel sure. for uh, yeah. underground if you want. Mm -hmm. Do you want underground as well or no? Uh, sure. Okay, so here you go. Two steel, one barrel, please. All right. I need steel, sadly. Um, Steel's on that corner. Ooh. 
I don't need bridges at the moment. You have to think of what action you might be using in the near future. <laughs> One, two steel. Three. Four. I'm just going to get four steel. That's it. Okay. I'm going to hire, and I'm going to do it twice. I'm going to hire at the level two. Uh, two level one, two level two? Uh, two level twos. Okay. So the barrel and the wood, and then the, two, sorry, two barrels and a wood, and mm. two wood and a coin. There you go. All right, you're up, Caleb. So if all my guys are on here, I have to remove this one first. If you're gonna, if you have to remove, you must remove a one, a one in the middle. So yes, that guy has to be removed. Okay. Can you use an action? You can. You can get more straightaways if you'd like. Mm -hmm. Do you want more straightaways? Or you can also trade in a barrel for a tunnel. Um. So as you upgrade this area, you're gonna be able to use all of it whenever you get on a, a, a space like that. It's really nice. Um, <laughs> I think I need to get another, well, you can get up to two straightaways and one underground. Ooh. I think I might need, I think I might, hmm. Come on now, <laughs> just hurry it up, Junior. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, you got, you got 60 seconds to turn. This is gonna be a long game otherwise. I'll do the straight away. Yep. Is that all you need? Is that all you need? Well, what do you mean? Do you want to do? Do you want to spend a barrel for an underground? Sure. Mm -hmm. I thought it was either. I thought it was no. Or. You you do the action like it says on here, mm -hmm. plus any bonus actions, and then you carry out your entire train. All of these guys and all the ones on the bottom. So me, I have a bunch of steel. I, I need to get rid of that. I need to actually craft uh, these. This guy here. But I don't have any bonus actions left now. And all of this is covering up my ability to play. Why do you have to get rid of the steel? I need to have I need train tracks. I can't get any train tracks from here, can I? Yes, but three, it, coins. three coins. You have to have three actions, yeah. I'm gonna go here, I guess. I'm just gonna be able to trade one steel in, sadly. Actually, You'll get not, to activate. Actually it's not bad. Yeah. So I'm gonna get steel for one straight away. And then I can trade another steel in for another straightaway. Remember, you get the bottom first. Oh, yeah, I get gold. matters for your inventory. Oh. Well, I just get rid of a barrel. Then I can turn a barrel in for a mountainous path. Mm -hmm. um, I can do more straightaways, I guess, for a, a, a wood. Oh, no, that's for a bridge. Yeah, I'll do that. Wood for a bridge. And another steel for another straight away. Sure, why not? Okay, I'm done. Okay, I'm gonna grab some gold. Take out here, and I'll get two gold. One, two. Thank you. Good, Caleb. Finally, I can build. <laughs> and you take that off. You can build. Uh, you can build up to two across. Yep. One. Two. Uh -huh. Three. And four. Yep. You know what? Across. That's gonna get you eight points. <laughs> Sixteen. Choose a house or choose to do victory points. Okay. And uh, that's it, I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have to as well now. 
three, six, nine. Hmm. How many water? I just have one water location. I can't go through there either. Dang. Now, if I want, can I attach to his? Yes, but you have to continue on to a city that's not connected. Okay, one, two. Very far, yeah. I think I can do it. Oh! So I can place this here. I'm going to activate that. Now I'm going to get this is one. And then... And this will go like this, and it'll mm -hmm. convert this into a triple path. Like that. Yeah. And then I have to go over here, right? Mm -hmm. One, and then a bunch of tunnely ones. Tunnel, tunnel. Straight away. Another mountain, and they'll fly me to the moon. Whoa, okay. Yeah. So now we look at from your spot to the closest city. One, two, three, four, five, ten points. Ten points. And Caleb's going to get points three, as well? Three points because you used his city to go through. Geez, so I lost out on my... Yeah, uh-huh. I wonder why that mechanically is how it is. I don't really like that. Yeah. I feel like I just wasted... Because now, he got there first. Yeah, I don't know. So I could could end the game or <laughs> now you guys are. Can I over it, can here. I go that way since you built that? So if you're the one So just like connect. me, I was here, my okay. city, and yours was here. I connected my train tracks to yours and then I extended to the next city. So you have to go from one city that you're at to another city that's not occupied. By that. Exactly. So, so I had to I had to go it. all the way to here. And I got nothing for putting spaces um, here, here, and here. Mm -hmm. And then I attached to yours, right? But I can't stop here, so I had to keep going five more spaces to get to a new city. So don't forget to put down your house, or maybe you want that one. So more victory points. now it's been made more difficult for me. Uh, you made it more difficult for me, too, because I was going to go here. <laughs> well, I was going to go there, well, too. <laughs> so what, but what you're saying Eventually. is that I have to build from... No, no, you don't have to do anything. No. You can literally go from here to here, or from here to here, or from here to here. You can go to any, any other city that you want, mm -hmm. as long as I'm not with it, uh, as long as I'm not uh, on it. But if you do wish to use my train tracks... You may, but you may not stop here. So you, if, for instance, if you wanted to go to the city, you would go, all this is free, and then I'm going to have to spend two tunnels and a straightaway to get to here, and then you would place your guy here. Does that make sense? Yeah. And then I, you get victory points for everything in this area. I was going to, I, I was going to say the exact same thing that you said, but I was mm -hmm. going to say if I wanted to do that, I'd have to go through here, here, if I wanted to. Can this connect to your other train or no? Sure. You just you can't just have the same train on yeah. somebody else's You didn't uh, need track. to connect. It doesn't have to be your train or your Yeah, train. If, if Callie wanted to, she could just simply go from here to... There and end it, yeah. Well, could you actually? Because you can't stop there. Well, not on that oh, one. Oh, well... Or is that the, is it the game ending way yeah. it goes? Uh... But yeah, I think I got a lot of tracks. I, I kind of pushed the game ahead a little fast mm -hmm. because Callie was starting to ramp up too too well. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> got me too nervous. So what does it say? Ending the game. It's probably literally in bold that says ending the game. Mm -hmm. No, right there. End of the game. One, one paragraph. The end of the game is triggered when there is a complete railroad from one side of the map to the other, regardless of who laid the track tiles. Whoever lays it completes the route, gets 15 points immediately. Yeah, but that doesn't say whether I could stop there. I guess you would have to. Or if I could, I have to keep going to a new city, I think. Lay, laying tracks. To any... 
to any city. Mm-hmm. It's a fairly important rule, because we don't... Yeah, for the end here. Don't want to get this wrong. When you reach a city on the map, you must build either a telegraph station or a railway station. Yeah, we got that. Yeah. Da -da. Your action must always end with either building a railway station or a telegraph station. Oh, so you could have stopped here and built a telegraph station. Um, I could have. I think so. So I don't have. We don't have to continue if we don't want. We don't, we can actually be only on the same. If, only if both buildings are already on there. Do you have to continue? I think. Ah. Yeah. Okay, so we can. You can actually. So p two trains can exist on the same space, provided that both buildings haven't been built. Mm -hmm. I see. Well, it is your turn, nonetheless. Okay. Well, I think I'll have to. Get, I feel like he's kind of lost down there now. <laughs> Look at my guy, he's gone nowhere. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I need one more tunnel. Uh, for that, sure, we will. I can do, do the this one, okay? Spending gold, yes. Spend a gold to get um, two barrels. Thank you. Uh huh. Go ahead, Caleb. Uh. Now it's once you do the bonus action here, then you'll process all this. Oh yeah. Right? I'm sorry, I was supposed to do this next. Then. Do you look at your turn though? Figure out what yeah. you want to do. Because this, you should be. In this game, you should probably know what your next turn is. There's nothing that's going to stop you from taking your turn. In almost any instance, there are a few exceptions to that rule. Yeah, I'll get uh, two tunnels and a track. Okay. I'm like, that's why I was doing that action. <laughs> One, two, and a track. Thank you. If I remove him, I can still build. Yes. Okay. One. And then a tunnel. Yeah, it doesn't matter. You can just put it on there. You do either one, tunnel or track. Yeah. Oh, because it has a little, I guess you can do like that. And yeah, this will fly over here. Okay. You can choose house or you can choose victory points. You might want victory points. Games come in a, might come to a close, uh -huh. depending on what people do. <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, and you're gonna get four points. One, two, three, four. All right, my turn. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I have no guys in the, on here anymore. So, that's a dangerous question, I guess. Yeah, I guess I'll remove this guy and I'll take the action yeah. of the monies. So I'll spend <laughs> this guy here. Um, to let me do this once, and I think I'll just gain three points ho, ho, ho. to catch up here. <laughs> I'll get my gold back, and I can spend a steel and a barrel here for a cave and a straightaway. Cave and a straightaway. And that's it, I don't have anything else I can do. I'm gonna build a couple tracks. That's That makes more sense now going to here, because I, I would have not lost any victory yeah. points. I lost out on these three, because I thought that I couldn't do mm -hmm. that. So I lost six oh, points there. I'm sorry. I do there, then I can't go there. Hmm. Okay, then I'll just go here. I want to 
put more building down. <laughs> it's going to give you six points. Actually, I'll put, yeah. One, two, three, four, down. five, six to 19. Me and Caleb points. are 23. Two more points for the Oh, do you just get them instantly? Yes. One, two, and so I would get three points then. Yeah. yeah. One, two, three, and Caleb's going to get one. I didn't realize those happened instantly. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I don't have enough to do another. No. Unless I did it to Caleb. Can you attach it to yeah. his his railway? All right. Yes, but I want to. So you could you could attach it, go here here and then just go straight to there. Uh huh. I did not know that either. I don't know. You could Wait. just simply attach your railway to somebody else's. Yeah. Why wouldn't you be able to go that way? Oh oh oh! But but can you connect it? No, I asked if you oh, connect it to one of these. You can, but you won't get points then. I thought you would. If I if you went from here. And you went this way, you would get all the points from this space back that, it, that you placed, right? That That's you what you placed, said. Yeah. So, yeah, you would get yeah. points. Yeah, for what you placed. But if Correct. you're using someone else's. They would track, get the three points. Yeah. So, yeah, if you use so, one or two of their spaces, it doesn't matter how many spaces, that you, but you can still use, you can still attach yourself anywhere, is mm-hmm. what you're saying. Mm-hmm. Okay. You I can, thought it was you just. You can use anyone's track. I always. see. That's another always. way in which, that is another way in which you can connect yeah. to the end yeah. of the game. Yeah. Okay. Th- and then three points for this one. And then Caleb gets three points because I used his station. Oh, just because you you walked, you went on it. Yeah. So whether they use their track or station, it's three points. Mm-hmm. I see. Well, it's not, it doesn't matter the track, it's the station that matters. I see. Yeah. Okay, Caleb? Um, I need barrels. Track. So you're going to get one, two, three, four barrels. A lot of barrels. All right, I am going to... Is there any reason that I should place this guy? No, I'm gonna take this guy off to build. Yeah. And we're gonna do two tunnels and a straightaway. So it'll take me from here to here, and then over here. Oh. And this will go over You're here. You're not gonna connect right there. <laughs> it, doesn't it connect though, or no? Oh uh, yeah, they do connect here. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And okay. I'll place that there for three more points. That's true. One, okay. two, and three. You give a three-way connection. Yeah, this guy here. Let's make it look pretty. <laughs> Looks like that, right? And now you've connected. So, the east and so the that's west. another way in which you can end yeah. the game as well, just connecting adjacent railways, right? Uh-huh. And does that when that happens, is the game instantly over, or is there an extra turn, or? It's. I'm pretty sure it's in, it's triggered. You complete uh, your route, you get 15 victory points instantly. Players continue taking their 44. turns until everyone has had equal number of turns. So you went first. I did. Right? So okay, you so each can have one more turn. I can still get some. Um, you get points for tracks. You get points for some end game scoring, too. Yeah, for whatever you have left in your inventory. Um, the most telegraph towers. The most houses out here, which we never built any. Yeah, we never built any. <laughs> most gold in your area, and the most guys that use barrels. Um, I guess I could get some gold. Okay. Well, give me one, two, three. All right, Caleb. So she's got the gold victory condition, most likely. <laughs> um, guys who use barrels, you don't. You have one guy who does, so if you put another, I think you would tie with Callie. Yeah, that... and then we won't, neither of us gets points. Um, you yeah. could go for, what's this one here? This one is houses on this board here. If yeah. you put one house on this board here, you'll get three three points. Mm-hmm. And then this one is um, whoever has the most of these guys. Yeah. And we, me and Callie both We're have tied. Tie, or tied. So you can put a house on here. That might help you. And it'll give you two victory points in addition to that as well. So that's five points. Mm-hmm. Um, how do I do that? Take one of your characters, place it adjacent to the space, then you'll get steel, so you'll get one steel. Then you can turn in a wood. Do you have a wood? You do. And you're going to get two victory points for doing that. One, two. And then you'll take one of your houses and you'll put it anywhere on any of these mm-hmm. spaces. Oh. The, no, on, on the little house spaces. Yep. Alright. And... That's, That's the end of the game. Yep, now we calculate it up. So how do we go through the calculations? 
So, um, the... Getting, uh, the attaching the trains is really strong. A lot of points. Yes. So, <laughs> we're going to look at how many railway stations and telegraph um, stations we have out on the build, like board combined. So, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And, and you we're going to look on the chart here for how And you can look points. on them as here as well. One, two, three, yeah. four, five, six, seven. So we look at our sevens. We both got 23 points, right? Yes. So 44 and 23, mm -hmm. 67. But some of your houses may be on here, so that's why you wouldn't want to do uh, okay. that normally. Oh, that's, so that doesn't count for here. Yeah. All right. Uh, seven for you. Mm -hmm. uh, 24 and? So it's 23. So 47? Yes. And Caleb, you have five, six of them. And six is going to give you 18. 18 and 29. 17 and 30 is Wait, 47. Yes. Five. Because one of his. Oh, oh. Yeah. That's what I was saying. Yeah. 14. Uh, who's here? 39, 29. So 14, mm -hmm. 13, 43. Choo choo. Um, and then... Then we do the bonus scoring goals. Which are these so, guys? Yeah. Uh, whoever has the most... Of Telegraph station. Me and Callie have the same amount. Tied, three. Tied, so neither of us gets points. Uh, <laughs> houses on this board here. Caleb. Three points for Caleb. Three points. Uh, gold and storage, oh, Callie. four. One, two, three. And then the final is characters with rum. I have one. Or and not barrels. rum, barrels. Or gunpowder. I have two. two. One, two, three. Yep. Is that it? That's it. And that's oh. the game, Pacific Rails mm -hmm. Inc. Oh, Michael wins that... with 67 <laughs> points. Well, I think really, I mean, I didn't realize how powerful connecting is. 15 game. points, uh -huh. look at the difference. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So you would have won if you just connected, if you could have, right? So it was actually really close. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching another Unfiltered Gamer board game live playthrough for the game Pacific Rails Inc. by Vesuvius Media and Ello. If you're interested in picking up the game, there is a link down below in the description. You can also go ahead and check out what we do on YouTube and of course, uh, unfilteredgamer.com. Blog posts, giveaways, Kickstarter lists, and more. We're going to be putting out new giveaways next week, in fact. You can also check out our game, Moonshell Mermaid Game. It's Callie's game that she's made. And then uh, the next game we are making is called Zero Day. And that game is going to come out sometime early next year. And we'll start showing off art and all that stuff for you guys as well. And I think it looks you guys, really good. I hope, I hope you guys will like it. <laughs> um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification button down below. Or if you're watching this on anything else like Twitch, go ahead and follow us here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, we look forward to seeing you guys next time.